Look at this picture. If you think this is scratch 2, look closely. This is actually scratch 3. That looks very very similar to scratch 2. Now as you cannot download scratch 2 anymore and my older video on the same topic is pretty old now. Let me show you some more add-ons that you can use to make scratch 3 look even more like scratch 2. So let's get started. First of all, you need a Google Chrome extension called scratch add-ons. So before we get into the installation part, let me tell you that this extension is completely safe to install. It does not take any personal information at all. So feel free to use it. So to get scratch add-ons, go to scratchaddons.com and click on install. And this will redirect you to the Chrome Web Store page. Here, click on add and wait for it to get installed. Then in the top right corner, click on this 3D box icon or maybe the puzzle icon. That totally depends on your browser. Click on it and select scratch add-ons. Now go to the add-ons section. Now first I'll go through the add-ons I covered in my last video. So first search stage and turn on display stage on the left side. This will basically put the stage on the left side instead of right. Then search for block shape and turn on customizable block shape. Then click on this arrow to expand, scroll down and choose the scratch 2.0 block shape preset. This will basically change the shape of your blocks to scratch 2.0 block shapes. Then search block color and turn on customizable block colors. Then click on this arrow to expand, scroll down and choose the scratch 2.0 block colors preset. This will basically change the color of your blocks to scratch 2 block colors. Now as we are done with the old stuff, here are the new changes. So first search border and turn on remove curved border. This will basically make the corners of the stage sharp, making it more like scratch 2. Then search editor and turn on customizable editor colors then click on this arrow to expand scroll down and choose the scratch 2.0 colors preset this will basically change the colors of your editor to scratch 2.0 colors then search reverse and turn on reverse order of project controls this will shift the project control buttons from left to right just like we had in scratch 2 then search column and turn on two column category menu this will change the appearance of the category menu from one column to two column just like scratch 2 this is actually next level. Then search compact and turn on compact editor. This will make the editor more compact in a lot of ways which I think feels like scratch 2 in some way. Then search context and turn on colored context menus. This will make the right click context menu have the color of the selected block instead of white just like scratch 2. Then search delete and turn on hide delete button. This will just hide the delete button in the sprite pane to make it look more like scratch 2. And have a look. This looks so much like scratch 2. Watch this video next and thank you for watching.